It's been many days since huh? I've had such a dream. Mm. What does it mean? Maybe I should go to the forest mm. to hunt to relax. <laughs> that was Prince Adrian, a mm. handsome, talented, <laughs> and passionate about hunting person. He was loved by many girls, but still had not found his right puzzle. That day, because he was engrossed in hunting, and when the moon rose, mm. he got lost mm. in an old castle in the forest where a lake flew through. <gasps> a splendid old castle. Surely this country used to be very prosperous. But why is it so dilapidated now? Adrian suddenly <gasps> saw a beautiful swan being chased by a fierce crocodile. He quickly raised his bow to shoot. His arrow made the crocodile run away in fear. Don't be afraid, you're fine. Suddenly, the swan turned into a very beautiful girl. Thank you for saving my life. Unbelievable. Why is it so similar to my dream? <gasps> uh, don't mention it. That's what I should do. I am Prince Adrian. And who are you? How could you turn into a swan like that? I am Princess Iris. This castle was once my home. In the past, this place was a poor kingdom. Since the wizard Jared appeared, he used magic to help the king and the kingdom become rich and powerful. <laughs> Seeing that he could do many things, my father named him Prime Minister. Since then, the kingdom had completely depended on him. He had acquired all power in the court that day. Is the princess here too? Then it's the right time. I have long admired the beauty of Princess Iris. Now I want to ask the king to allow me to marry you. So I can both marry a beautiful princess, and I can easily take the throne of this kingdom. <laughs> In your dream! I will never accept that! Whatever I become, it's better than being your wife! You dare to refuse a powerful wizard? All right then, get ready to suffer my wrath. I curse the castle and this kingdom will forever sink into oblivion, and Princess Iris will become a swan forever. You can only turn back into a human on full moon nights. Unless you sacrifice yourself, I will not let go of this castle. Princess Iris turned into a swan. From then on, the castle gradually sank into oblivion in the deep forest. She went on and on to find a way to lift the curse, turn back into a human, and save the kingdom. What should I do now? In the end, Iris was so lucky that she met a fairy and got the advice from her to lift the curse of the wizard. You must find your true love. If he proposes to you on the night of the full moon, you will turn back into a human. Then the curse will be lifted, and the wizard will lose all magic. Be careful. If it's not true love, it won't work. Then you will have to live as a swan for the rest of your life. <sighs> Poor you. That evil wizard is obnoxious. If I ever meet him, I will definitely demand justice for you. They talked throughout that night, and gradually realized they liked each <laughs> other. From then on, Adrian often went alone to the castle in the woods to befriend Iris, both when she was a swan <laughs> and when she turned you. <laughs> Their love grew more huh? and more. That day, Adrian decided to express yeah. his love to Iris. 
Iris, do you believe in our love? Surely my sincerity will lift the curse for you. Come to my palace tomorrow night and accept my marriage proposal. Adrian, I believe in you. I'll be there tomorrow night. However, the two did not know that the evil wizard Jared had always been watching Princess Iris and knew of their appointment. The next evening, when the moon rose at Adrian's palace, there was a great party. As expected, the beautiful Princess Iris appeared on time. Iris, you're here. Huh? Adrian, hurry up! Hurry up and propose to me in front of so many people! Iris, why are you so impatient? It's not like you as usual. Well, that's because I'm so anxious to lift the curse! Adrian, let's go! Let's meet your parents right now! Dear father, mother, and all the guests here, this is the Princess Iris, the one I love. And from today, she will be my wife. Iris, will you agree to marry me? Wait! Adrian, you're wrong! I am the real Iris! Since the full moon rose, I had to pass through the forest to get here. That's why I'm late. What's going on? Who is my real Iris? If the newcomer is the real Iris, then who did I propose to? At that time, the fake Iris revealed his true form <gasps> as the evil wizard. I am the wizard Jared. The one you just proposed to is me, not Iris. So the curse won't be lifted. Iris will be a swan forever. <laughs> you, the evil wizard. True love. What true love that you can't recognize your lover, the real princess. Liar! <gasps> Iris, I'm sorry. I didn't expect that the wizard... His wizardcraft is so powerful. It's all over, Adrian. I no longer have hope to lift a curse and turn back into a human. <laughs> Jared, I accept to sacrifice myself. I only ask you to spare my father and my kingdom. Princess, prove it to me with your actions. When I'm satisfied, I'll spare your kingdom. <gasps> Adrian, how is it? Why did you relate to the curse and that evil wizard? Father, mother, I will explain this after I found her. <gasps> Iris fled Adrian's palace. She returned to her castle by the lake and looked at it one last time. Will you keep your word and release everything? Don't worry, I promise to keep my word. Iris went to the lake. At that moment, Prince Adrian also chased there. No, Iris, don't! You want to save the princess? It's not that easy. The evil wizard. I will risk my life with you. Adrian rushed to attack the wizard, but he easily disarmed and knocked him away. At that time, Iris jumped into the lake and drowned. <laughs> it's your end for daring to go against me. No, Iris! Iris! Don't waste your time searching in vain. Do you think she can live underwater for that long? <laughs> It's all my fault. I was too rude, I got the wrong person, and could not free Iris, but also pushed her to this painful end. I can't live without Iris. Dear gods, please allow me to sacrifice myself to save Iris's life. After praying, Adrian resolved to jump into the lake with his lover and quickly drown. That's stupid. Giving up your life for a girl? That's fine. I don't have to worry anymore. But soon, he couldn't believe his eyes anymore. A oh. miracle happened. Ah. A miraculous wave of water ah. brought both Adrian and Swan up from the bottom of the lake. The fairy appeared satisfied. <gasps> True love is voluntary self-sacrifice for each other, able to cross the boundaries of life and death. Adrian's love for Iris 
is true love. <gasps> huh? You are back to human. Huh? The curse of the evil wizard Jared has been lifted. <gasps> Iris, I'm glad you're back with me. I promise <laughs> I won't lose you again. The sun rose. The whole castle was bright and full of light. Iris's kingdom was quickly revived <laughs> and completely restored to its former self. <laughs> the two countries happily congratulated the wedding of Prince Adrian and the swan <laughs> Princess Iris. <laughs> They live happily ever after. <laughs>